Insiders are abuzz about Peyton Manning's potential return to football. Football legend Peyton Manning has only been retired from the National Football League for less than two years, but he's already being recruited for other football-related roles. In fact, Cleveland Browns owner Jimmy Haslam is seriously interested in having Manning join his franchise as a top executive, a league source told CBS Sports. Haslam, whose team hasn't won a game the entire 2017 season, has become desperate to find ways to put a winning football operations and coaching staff together and apparently believes that the former MVP and Super Bowl winning quarterback would be the answer. However, Manning has not indicated a desire to take his first post-playing position in Cleveland, although many people believe his love for the game will result in an eventual run as a franchise executive. Even then, the Browns likely wouldn't be Manning's first choice, as he was raised in New Orleans and played college football in Tennessee, both of which have professional football teams of their own. Not to mention that his frequent appearance on the sidelines of the University of Tennessee football games has sparked curiosity among volunteer fans about his potential return to their program. Haslam, a University of Tennessee booster, has known Manning since the superstar athlete was a high school student being recruited by the college. The Browns have been in a continuous state of rebuilding for nearly five seasons, particularly due to woes in the quarterback position, Bleacher Report noted. Those frustrations haven't been easy on fans, who have wondered why the current executives passed on all-star quarterbacks Carson Wentz and Ishan Watson in recent drafts. Adding Manning to the executive team would give a level of knowledge and understanding that just might be the answer to the team's issues, not to mention the much-needed excitement and confidence the move would give the Browns fan base. As of now, though, Manning hasn't indicated any concrete future plans. We just hope he keeps doing those catchy nationwide jingles. Jingles.